I feel like in the first episode, Olivia, we learn a lot about you and your desires to be a mother. So when do you want to have kids by? I want to have, I want to have children soon, like within the next two, three years. Is that on the agenda you said in, in the next two to three years? Yeah, I, I think so, I hope so. I took steps in the show like to get me to, toward that, so I don't want to give away too much, but you'll see in the show like the, the decisions that I made to kind of, what, what were you saying, we were like, to take back your power. Yeah, and to, to try to take that situation into my control. Did and you, so it's really exciting. Did you freeze your eggs? Well, it's in the process. Okay. Which would be... They're getting chilly. They're getting yeah. chilly. <laughs> yeah. How yeah. has that conversation been with Christian? Is this something that he wants? Do you guys want an engagement first? We definitely talk about it. He's so busy right now, and he's yeah. had such a great... Um, his career is obviously really important right now for him and he's killing it and it's amazing. So we talk about it, but I don't put a ton of pressure on it. We're on the same page. Yeah. We're headed in the right direction. And um, that's really all that I can say at this point, but I think that we're definitely on the same page about everything with that. And I'm really excited. He had a big game. Yeah. This weekend. Mm -hmm. How does he feel about the cameras rolling on you? And then how did you guys celebrate that? It's been so exciting. Yeah. Honestly, I'm so proud of him and having each other during these changes is comforting and exciting and um, especially, I mean, as for Sunday, like you couldn't have expected anything better. So it's fun. I, I mean, just doing life together is yeah. more fun than doing it alone. So I'm so proud of him. I'm so excited for the future. I'm excited to have him in California. It makes yeah. things a lot easier for me. <laughs> Are you living up there with him? No, I live, okay. I live here. Yeah. What's the key to that? Long like distance. Long distance, yeah. I always say, I feel like with long distance, it's you're usually long distance because you're pursuing something that you're really passionate about. And part of really loving and respecting somebody is understanding the things that they have to do to reach their potential. So I think we have a great understanding of that. And we allow each other the space to do what we need to do. But at the end of the day, we also come back and make each other feel like we're priorities. So yeah. it's perfect. In our family, there's no boundaries. There's no filter. Very inappropriate, love you. <laughs> and there is no shortage of drama. Why was now the time to do a family reality show and to really give us a glimpse into your lives? Oh, well, well it just happened to me when all of um, our drama was happening. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's, it's, it was kind of an, an organic, gradual process because we, we are all pretty um, vulnerable on our Instagrams. People are like, oh my God, the three yeah. of you together, it's so entertaining, you should have a show. So many years of that, and we were like, yeah, me, Olivia, maybe we should just put your feelers out and shop it around. And then we ended up making connections and other people thought it would be a great idea too, and now here we are. We're all super close. Love you guys, cheers. Even though sometimes we wanna kill each other. Hey. Yeah, we were really lucky the way that it landed. Even the way it landed on TLC straight to series, that's so hard. I was do, so yeah. pleasantly surprised. So it's fun. I feel like it's going to be, it's different. Yeah. Was there anything off limits when you guys went into filming? We kind of no. made it a rule that that wasn't, really? if we were going to do it, we were going to fully go in on it. Yeah. yeah. To show the good, bad, and the ugly. Yeah. Really. I mean, the only things that are can be tough is when you're maybe, ex you don't want to exploit anybody that doesn't want to be, yeah. that wants to keep sure. things private. But as far as us and our perspectives, we really are, we're open books. Yeah. yeah. If I were really a bitch, I would tell you to not wear my thing. Olivia, you are a bitch. Yeah. Are you guys ready for the Kardashian comparisons? I don't, we We've just never don't heard see of them. them. We actually don't know, no, I'm just saying. <laughs> We're three sisters, so I think that's where the comparison comes but we from. But yep. further apart. Yeah. The thing about this show that's so interesting, that's so cool is the juxtaposition between our life in LA and our life in Rhode Island where we came from. And I, I know you saw a little bit of the first episode, but our yeah. parents, like, they're just so quirky. My parents have absolutely no idea what I do. Oh my God. They call I Olivia always... an influencer, but we don't know because we're not influenced by it, sorry. In, um, like my mom comes in the room with something she picks from someone's trash. Like that's like what she does like every day. Like yeah. it's just yeah. totally different. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It couldn't be more different. It really could I'll be take more being different. a boss businesswoman though. I'll take yeah. that yeah, comparison right? any day.